I look back on everything now and the drugs, I consider them to have been my medicine at the time. It was the only thing that would numb me out that I didn't have to feel the hell that I was feeling in my spirit. So the bottom for me during that time was not wanting to live anymore. I'd lost my faith. Every relationship I touched crumbled. It was really difficult to even find a reason to get up in the morning, to put my shoes on, put my boots on. And I finally had to make a decision that I wanted to live. And actually that happened when my sister told me she was pregnant with my nephew. And that little boy gave me a big reason to want to live and to work harder, try harder, be better. Two weeks after I came out publicly on Entertainment Tonight, I was back out on the road. I was a little nervous about it because, to be quite honest with you, I knew there might be a chance that I couldn't do music anymore. And two weeks after that interview aired, I was singing at another sold-out show, man. And once again, just stunned at God's grace. And after the show, I had these parents walk up to me and. They had that 14-year-old kid with them, and his dad looked at me and said, okay, this kid wants to be in country music, and he just came out to us. And I knew in that sobering moment exactly what my life was gonna be like. I get to sit down and talk to kids, or a 70-year-old man that came to the show and said, through your story, I had the courage to come out to my kids, come out to my family. That's a big deal. <laughs> 